And those neighbors I spoke with tell me they cannot believe this international story is unfolding right here in their backyards. You can see police still have Maple Street blocked off tonight as this federal investigation continues. I don't think you ever really see this coming. Robert McNamara says nothing like this happens in their quiet North Dayton neighborhood. When you get the national news and, and headlines, I've got friends from California texting me what's going on in your neighborhood. The FBI took Jack Texera into custody this afternoon. The Massachusetts Air National Guard airman walking backward with his hands on his head into custody, accused of leaking federal classified documents. If you think you're being a patriot, why don't you check first before you go doing something like that? I would never have kind of taken him somebody like that. So it's kind of crazy. Some who knew the 21 year old from their time at Dighton Rehoboth High School say he was into gaming and the military. Just wanted to live a, like live his life, um, dip his toes into the military, stuff like that. I think he's like a good kid. I don't think he's like really doing anything like malicious. I think he's probably just on Discord messing around with his friends. As the federal investigation continues, some in the quiet neighborhood weigh the seriousness of the allegations. To a certain degree, yeah. Yeah, I mean, if uh, it's treason, you're, you're turning over classified information. I, I view it the same way. It's, it's unfortunate. A lot of the neighbors I spoke with today say Jack Texera and his family are quiet, that many people here don't know them. One woman did tell me that Texera's mother does sell flowers from a farm stand in front of the family home in the spring and summer months.